Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install Android 13 on the Google Pixel 3. Now, we will be using a custom ROM known as Pixel Experience for the purpose of this video. Why? Because Google has officially abandoned the Google Pixel 3, which means it is going to stay at Android 12 from Google's point of view. Now, what are the things which you need? Well, you do need to unlock your bootloader and you need to have a custom recovery installed videos for all of those can be found in the description of the video next thing make sure your battery is charged at least 50 to 60 percent do not and i repeat do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30 percent also make sure you have a backup of all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device because we are going to perform a format data and you are going to lose all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device and before you ask me hey manji can i do a dirty flash from pixel experience Android 12 well me personally I don't recommend it but if you're brave enough to try it feel free to do so and if it works for you do let us know via comments below so here it is this is the Google Pixel 3 which right now is running Android 12 the first thing you need is of course the ROM zip file for pixel experience based on Android 13 for the Google Pixel 3 here it is the link is in the description of the video all you need to do is download the latest build which is available next thing you need to do is you will go into settings then you will go into security remove your screen lock your face unlock if you have any setup on a custom ROM and remove your passwords as well then you can go back into settings and then you will go into passwords and accounts and remove any google account which is associated with your device now once you've removed all the accounts and security measures make sure you reboot your device once and why are we removing all the accounts and security measures we are doing this because we are switching from one rom to another and i don't want you to be locked out of your own device however if you're comfortable signing back into your google account on initial setup then feel free to not remove your google account the next thing we need to do is boot our device into our custom recovery and we are using twrp recovery for the purpose of this video so press and hold your power button and then you need to select restart as soon as the screen goes black press and hold volume down and once you keep and holding volume down you will boot into the fast boot mode here and if you press the volume rockers you will switch between the different options so as you can see right now we are on recovery mode and at this point press the power button to boot into your custom recovery and of course in our case it is twrp so you will be on the bootloader unlocked splash screen then you will get the google logo and then eventually you will boot into your custom recovery again we are using twrp now once we have booted into twrp we will go into wipe advanced wipe and here you need to select dalvik and data and then swipe to wipe once that process has finished successfully tap on the home button go into install here and navigate to the folder where you have the official build of pixel experience based on android 13 for the google pixel 3 in my case i downloaded it on my phone directly so it is in the download folder and all you need to do over here is select the rom now once you have selected the rom you will be on this screen here and if you do not want your twrp to be replaced with stock pixel experience recovery then you need to select this option of automatically reflash twrp after flashing a rom now super important thing to note over here is that if you select this option and you get an ota on your pixel experience android 13 build on the pixel 3 then you will not be able to apply that OTA because we are using TWRP so you will have to manually update if you're using pixel experience recovery then the OTA will be applied automatically in my case I will check this option and then swipe to confirm flash now once the zip file has flashed successfully we are going to scroll up make sure there were no errors and as you can see there were no errors in flashing pixel experience Android 13 on the Google pixel 3 tap on the home button go into reboot and here and we are going to select recovery this is going to boot us back into our custom recovery which in our case again is twrp because we had checked that option of reflashing our recovery after flashing the rom so here it is we are back in twrp now at this point we are going to go into wipe format data type in yes and then tap on the check mark on the bottom right you can ignore the text in red now do note that format data 
will result in wiping out of all your pictures videos anything important which you have on your device so make sure you do have a backup of all those things and once the wipe process has finished successfully all you need to do is select reboot system and pretty soon we should get the boot animation right now we are on the bootloader unlock splash image or splash screen on the google pixel 3 and then we should have the pixel experience boot animation here it is this means we are booting into pixel experience based on android 13 on the google pixel 3 the first boot up will take some time so you have to be patient and here it is we are on the setup screen let me skip the initial setup real quick and here it is we have now successfully installed android 13 on the google pixel 3 and this of course is a custom rom known as pixel experience and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you